happening in the enterprise space is companies outside the tech world are figuring out they have to be cloud companies. Everyone has to try to reach, become a cloud company and reach their customers. And I, I would use these absurd examples like if you're a, floral, a florist company, you have to be a cloud company. If you're a cattle producer, you're a cloud company. And I gave those examples in the know when I was speaking. And lo and behold, two guys in the audience held their hand up, NetSuite customers said, I am, I sell flowers, and I'm a total cloud company. All I'm focused on is how I deliver my goods over the cloud. Literally, almost next to him was the, the sole producer of Kobe beef in the Philippines. You say, oh yeah, we're using NetSuite, we're tracking the cattle in, the, in NetSuite via RFID, we can tell which ones are sick, we can tell which ones are where they are in the fields, they're a cloud company. So what I believe is happening in the enterprise space is every company is becoming a cloud company. They're looking at their infrastructure, like SAP, like Microsoft Great Plains, go down your list of dead ERP applications, and they're saying, how can we possibly transform our own business if we run our company on these Stone Age applications that don't even know the internet exists, don't even know the cloud exists? And so what you're seeing is certainly SAP owns a lot of transactions, Microsoft Great Plains owns a lot of transactions, but at the end of the day, there's a replacement cycle going on as companies shift from a client server environment to a cloud environment, and it turns out there's basically one solution for them to shift to. Yeah.